Hello everyone, T-Man 978. I wasn't planning on doing the toy hunt, but I'm gonna do it because I've been seeing some cool things in this Target right here. Came to get my new glasses, but this thing is like freaking 18 inches tall. Only 40 bucks. It has double jointed elbows, double jointed knees, and it has like a toe joint. I can see that the foot goes up back and forward. And I was trying to move it around, I couldn't do it that much, but it seems like it has ankle pivot. Only problem is no thigh cut and no ab crunch. But, yeah, I can't believe that's only $40. It's hollow as hell, but that's way better than, and, and these things right here. These things are way better than the, the $10 Hasbro toys over here. These guys have like no elbow joints no knee joints meanwhile these have two points at the shoulders two points at the elbow they have knees where is it they have all that articulation right there like two points at each one of those points so that's crazy no ankle but for ten dollars and they even got this dude black matter that joker somebody hid this it was here the last time I was in here. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is here now. It used to be at Toys R Us only. Somebody left this here. Yep. Let's walk down. Nothing but old Marvel Legends. Deadpool wave for days. Classic. Amigo is in the middle of this section like they're real <laughs> action figures. We got that. Spider ham looking weird as crap. These people. Trying to walk slow so it won't be so much of a blear. I don't even know what to look for in the Jurassic Park section because I don't collect them. Marvel Rising still here. Transformers card game. Some of these Transformers are on sale. But there is a 25% off coupon. It's posted like everywhere if you're part of the syndicate and whatnot. They got three brawls. Lockdown and Jazz. That's the Studio Series 1 Bumblebee, unfortunately. These look cool. Like, whoa! These faces are, are nice for these little tiny figures. Wow. That almost makes me want to collect these. <laughs> Their faces look nice. I never paid attention to them that hard. Like, even that. That is a lot of detail for something that has five points of articulation. Like, that face right there looks as good as this one that's actually posed. No, this, that looks better. <laughs> these, I think, are older than, than these. The, just a solo wave. What's this? Somebody trying to hide Grimlock. They got these dudes. Look like he's on sale too. They got this thing. I think I neglected to zoom in on that when I was in here last time. Um, yeah, I like these turtles. These turtles, they're really cool. I mean, the cartoon might be whatever the cartoon is, but these figs, they're cool. So I might eventually wind up with all of them at some point. My only gripe is that Raphael is not as big as he should be. Like, he should be way bigger. Than the other turtles. Where is he? Must be gone. Stretch Armstrong. Okay. 
Full disclosure, I've been wearing those same glasses I had on forever. I'm just having fun being able to see in this store. <laughs> Everything looks a million times better. It's like going from a picture to screen to a to 4K. So I can't wait to see something in 4K. I'm gonna do this NECA area briefly. Not super interested in, well, I'm not gonna lie. If, if I had some of these, I'd probably be excited for it. This has been, this has caught my eye right here. I've seen him a bunch of times, like in different stores. Doesn't feel like anything. But that I've seen in person, I do not like that at all. Sorry, extra zero. Ready, freaking Kruger. If I can get the glare off of them. There we go. I like their sculpting looks so good. That suit looks real. I just seen a review for this dude. or No, not, not this dude, but... Another version on Jobby's channel. I heard it was like hard to find or something. But I see him often. And that face right there is spot on. Chucky. Well, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to slow walk over these pops. And these fuggler things. That unboxing art loves. Yeah, now I'm out of here. So, I'm in GameStop. I've never watched a review on these figures. Or, you know what? I think I did, but this really is scarlet. The plastic looks nice. I couldn't tell that in the video. And Black Panther is also like a shimmery, shiny plastic as well. Now, another store has the Gamerverse Marvel Legends Spider-Man, so I think I'm going to be patient. I don't know, because I... Do you have this guy? I don't have that unmasked Ben Riley head. That's the only thing making me interested. And let's go over here. I think these figures are still on sale. So they do have this randomly sitting here. This set right here. That set. I wonder, are these on sale? Because I still don't have um, the one I just picked up for this one. And I don't know why this is $5 more than these supposed to cost. They got World of Nintendo down here. Mario with Cappy. Unfortunately, Cappy can't fit on his head if you think that. No. Aquaman's trident. I was thinking it was a big giant statue. They got those metal Batman and Superman right there. No ab crunch. I'm not even sure if they have waist rotation. Let's see. I got this stuff. I don't see any like figure arts or anything. They do a lot of talking in this store. Instead of ringing you up. That always pisses me off. Oh, I've 
Jesus, that conversation is horrible. But they bring in some old amiibo back, as you can see here. What was this? Is that Luke? What? Oh, Rebel Soldier. They do have that guy. They have this stuff. I think, like, all this is on sale. I think. Purple hair, Psylocke. Limited edition freezer. And there is a Ronin back there. Honky Tonk Man, Shawn Michaels, NECA. People like these. I, I just can't. Pro tip for toy hunters, before you walk out the door to the store after filming, stop filming and actually look around. I'll look behind the counter and saw this. Multiple man. And they're on sale and I had a five dollar coupon, so ten dollars off. Yay me. All right, I'm at GameStop where the deal was super talkative because one of my favorite superheroes is supposed to be in here in Marvel Legends form. Let's find out if that's true. Welcome to GameStop. Inside this location, all items are being monitored, recorded for your safety and protection. Thank you for shopping at GameStop. Yeah, y'all get all that. I thought I pushed pause. But I guess in this store, I don't know pause from play. All this stuff should be on sale. Same stuff. Let me just look for what I'm looking for. Maybe his helpful butt can help me find what I'm looking for. There's a whole bunch of Fallout props coming out with seven sets for the holidays. Oh, 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 here it is. Here it is. Let's look over his deco. I hope it's on sale on the website. It's not. I'll let y'all know. It's probably going to take me forever to get out of here. Because they gotta help everybody. What are these? Alright, I'm done here. Um, when I find stuff, I don't feel like recording no more. Sorry. Okay, trust me, believe me, I was about to leave, but then I saw this at the last minute. I've never seen this in my life, so I need to pull that down to film it for you guys. It's a big, fully articulated Mega Man figure. I can see his shoulder and elbow joints, hips, looks like knees, maybe feet, no, no, the feet look solid to me, but it has some weapons in there, I'm not even sure if it has knees to be honest, um, it makes sounds, and it has those weapons, who makes this, Jack Specific, so the same people that make world of nintendo make this so you know what i'm gonna have to find out about the knees well it does specifically point at the knees no one else is gonna buy it please do <laughs> i don't know what the price is this thing is probably 20 bucks maybe 30 Okay, that GameStop is my lucky charm, and it's a Walgreens across the street. Lightning struck twice because I found the, um, the AIM soldiers in there last toy hunt. I believe that was last toy hunt. So, yeah, let's see if it can strike again inside of Walgreens.
you know I still haven't found a thing yet. Before I forget to mention it, I didn't get the price on that Mega Man figure. They didn't put a sticker on it because it just came in. And Spider-Man was on sale, like all action figures on sale at GameStop right now, like 25% off. But this is the only Walgreens that puts the toys towards the front. So you don't have to even look too hard. But Okay, I'm not gonna be able to stop myself. Oh yeah, they have Rekkar. Yeah. I don't see the thing, unfortunately for me. You see be in a blue box. But now this is the final figure I need. <laughs> but it's not on sale in here. Yeah. I should have looked up. It's him and some Terracons down there. And now I have to debate with myself. Do I get that Gladiator at full price? He is like the main figure I don't want in the wave. <laughs> Where is this supposed to go? Somebody was looking for cable, but I don't know who it is. You know what? I hate being, look, I'm in the position where I see a bunch of toys. So people think, well, and I ask T-Man. And T-Man has a million people asking him to look for stuff. And T-Man has a horrible memory. So it's like, I see the request, and then it's like, depending on who you are, it's instantly deleted. Especially if you're just a random. I, I'm sorry, but I like being honest on my channel. If you don't watch my reviews, I like being honest. So, yeah, I'm sorry in advance. Don't hate me. I think I'm getting it. We'll find out. Because he's the last guy I need to finish apocalypse <laughs> well I am home so it's time to show you my haul for anybody who stayed till this point in the video thank you so much I really super appreciate you I hope you already clicked the like button I wanted to show you what I picked up and I'm selling that guy um, yes this was on sale all the action figures at GameStop right now are on sale I hope that they are still on sale when you decide to watch this. Look at the date in the description. <laughs> but this isn't for me. It does look good. I really like the way the the red looks. It looks really, really nice. Extra Zero told me that he wanted it. I shared the pic a picture to the figure action group chat we have on Messenger. And he said he wanted it. I, I was shocked because he doesn't collect a whole bunch of Marvel Legends. But in the beginning portion of this toy hunt, I hope I have this that footage in this toy hunt. You might have seen me walking around with this. Yeah, I did pick that up. I did get this saber tooth. I picked them up days ago. That's why I'm doubting, doubting myself. And I already have Apocalypse partially together. You know what? Oh snap, I hope this haven't been reopened. It's just him and this fist. And it is the right fist. But it's like double layered tape on here, like somebody put more tape on it. I'm not gonna bore you to that photo. Oh, here this is. I got him out of there. And why don't we just go ahead and do this? Pop this on. It's hilarious that Wolverine comes with these two hose pieces <laughs> so they can make him fit in with this build a figure wave but leave him there and let me show you what else I got I did pick up multiple man this is a character I mean I know his power for the most part but I'm not super familiar with him like when I was reading the X-Men comics a lot of characters never came into play it's like I knew about them through other means. Like, 
I read about them in like different Marvel encyclopedias and whatnot, but I never actually got to see them in action. But now we have this freaking leg. Let me get multiple mana and some type of booze. Man, I've been playing the long game, as they say, for so long on this wave that I, I f almost forgot which other figures were in the wave. Luckily, I have the box. But multiple, man, the thing that sucks about him is you have to buy multiple of him for his ability to be looking effective at all. So, yeah. Let me shut up before I... I you know how some people, they do these whole portions and then they do a showcase and they'll be like, I'm not doing a full review. I'll let people like T-Man 978 do it. Well, guess what? I am T-Man 978, so y'all gonna have to wait. I, I'm, I might do a little bit of a close-up, but I'm not giving any opinions on them. And there's this guy. What's weird? They didn't glue. They didn't glue this packaging together. That's weird. Like, I could just pull this bubble out if I wanted to. That is weird right there. I've never experienced that. I mean, it does make him stand out. And this artwork right here, it's kind of weird. Like, I can tell this isn't Teenage Spider-Man. He definitely has an adult body. Like, with the way the gut kind of comes out a little bit. But he's still in shape, as you can see. And while wow, this packaging like this is intentional, I don't get it. I pulled this whole bubble out, and yeah, you know what? It was just like that. You know, no, 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 no. I think it was still supposed to be glued on the sides, and and they just didn't do that. So that that's weird to have one just come completely out like this. <laughs> Spoiler alert, figure of the year, figure of the year right here, I might be biased because Spider-Man is already my favorite, but like, holy moly, it's been a minute since they made a Spider-Man that's this good, a minute, like I liked 2099 Spider-Man. I think he was my figure of the year last year. But, um, yeah, this is pretty much using, like, that same body. But with, like, a arguably better deco. I don't know. I like 2099 still. But this looks more like traditional Spider-Man. And it's just as poseable as 2099. So, yeah. And he comes with different hands. I wish it would have had a web holding hand so I wouldn't have to do something like this. I'll talk about that in a review. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you're still enjoying it because it's not over yet. During this toy hunt, I also purchased this guy right here. Ba -da -ba. So yeah, I can finish Apocalypse right now. Gladiator is not too bad. It's weird, uh, I, this is the first time I can think of, unless I'm forgetting something, that they put two of this same body in one, one weave. I'm used to them giving us like two Bucky Cat molds or something like that, but this is the first time that I can think of where they gave us this body right here, twice. But here is the fully completed apocalypse right here. And why did you fall? Thank you, Spidey, for pulling him down. Anyway, how I feel about him? Well, if I've once I've really like look at him. To be continued at some point on T Man 978. Chill review. Click the notification bell. Thank you for watching. Click, click the videos. Click the videos, baby. Click, click the videos. You should review.